Hey guys, it's iPhone Else here, and today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your iPhone 3G or your iPod Touch second generation with the 4.1.1 firmware, the new firmware that everyone has been updated to. So this jailbreak is from uh, Snow Red Snow. It's a uh, code name Red Snower. So uh, there'll be a link in the sidebar where you can go to the Dev Team blog, and it has all the information. But I'll just explain it to you uh, briefly. So this will work with the iPhone 3G and the iPod Touch 2nd generation, uh, non-C model and uh, MC model. But for the MC model, uh, it's going to be tethered and for the non-MC model, it's going to be tethered. So the untethered means that you, don't have, uh, you can turn it, back off, turn it off and uh, turn it back on. And tethered means you're going to have to reboot it. When you turn it off, you're going to have to re jailbreak it basically. So all you have to do is, uh, and this is only for Mac. So if you don't have, if you have a PC, you're gonna have to wait because they're processing for the PC and they're testing it out right now as we speak. So they're gonna announce a PC version of it hopefully today or tomorrow. So make make sure you guys stay tuned. Uh, so this will only work with Mac. So what you wanna do is go to the Dev Team blog, and also you have to be updated to the latest firmware, which is 4.0. 4.1 so what you want to do there will be a link in the sidebar where you can download the firmware for your device so go to this uh, link in the sidebar and you can just uh, uh, scroll down and pick your uh, device and download the firmware and if you don't know what what kind of, if you have the iPod touch third generation or the iPod touch second generation just click here and it's going to say to enter your last characters of your device serial number so mine is let's go ahead and check this Basically, you go to general, you go to settings, general, and then you go to about, and then you'll see version, I mean, uh, serial number, and my three last digit is 75J, and then click enter, find, and it's going to tell you what generation of iPod you have. As you see, I have an iPod Touch third generation, it's black and it's capable of 8 gigabyte which is true so it's not this is not uh, false this is true information so if you guys don't know what device you have you can also check it out uh, with this little cool tool they have here so once you uh, download your firmware go back to the dev team blog and right here you'll see mac OS S X. you just have to download that and then it'll save it to your desktop but i'm not going to download that because i'm using pc so there's no point of me downloading it and also it won't work with me my iPod because I have the third generation. So I guess that's basically about it. Uh, sorry I can show you guys how to do it because I don't have the materials. And that's basically about it guys. And I'll be also having a, a video tomorrow for the Windows version. So make sure you guys stay tuned. That's, uh, yeah. And I hope it works out. If, if you guys have any problems just feel free to leave a comment below and I'll try to reply with the solution. So yeah guys, see about it. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.